Welcome to Marine Components International. My name is David Ayers, I'm Sales and Marketing Manager, and I'm here today to run through with you the range of solid state wind speed and direction sensors from Calypso Instruments. Calypso develops a range of solid state anemometers, uh, and they work by work with having four little transducer discs that send sound waves from the top there to the base plate below and back up. And they are constantly measuring the speed and the direction of flight of those sound waves. And any wind flow that goes over the autosat is being instantly calculated into accurate wind speed and direction. There are three variants within the range. There are two Bluetooth variants, a solar powered variant with a little solar disc on top and a battery inside and a battery variant that literally charges going directly onto a charge pad pad that gives you 150 hours of runtime. And then there's the wired version, which is NEMA 2000 ready and can wire directly into a NEMA 2000 backbone or chart plotter display. <clears throat> so I'll run through these in a little bit more detail with you. The solar powered version can run up to 29 days without any light whatsoever. There's a Bluetooth chip internally and that Bluetooth chip is sending data either directly to a free to use app, and there are a few variants of this, and it's giving you on the app true wind direction, true wind speed, average wind direction, and average wind speed. It's also giving you the boat's direction and location, and also a history graph as well. We should, all that data can be downloaded from the app into .csv Excel file format, so you can analyze that later. Then the battery version is also Bluetooth, works in exactly the same way. So say it charges on a charge pad and gives you up to 150 hours runtime um, in active use. If you wanted to collect, connect either of these to a NEMA network, then you would introduce the Calypso NEMA 2000 gateway, the data Bluetooth from the sensor into the gateway and then it's wired from there into your NEMA network or backbone, and it's transferring the NEMA, the Bluetooth data into NEMA 2000 data and uh, for you. The wired version is already NEMA 2000 ready, so it does not require the gateway at all, and can go straight into the backbone or into your chart plotter or display to give you the live data directly. The advantage of solid state wind sensors such as Calypso is there are no moving parts. So there's no ball bearings, there's no cups, and there's no veins. So there's no ball bearings to seize or cups to get broken by bird strike or by flying ropes or whatever else there may be out there. So they're far more reliable and far, far longer lasting. The range can be mounted onto your boat in many different ways um, with the either the mast mount here, which is for the Bluetooth solar, or for, the, or for the wired, and that can mount either vertically or on top of the mast horizontally. There's a little adapter plate which can be used for the wired sensor to make it fit, or it just this one just screws straight in with a screw plug that comes with it. There's a dinghy mast one here, which is for the small one that just offsets it from the mast slightly more, and a little screw goes straight underneath there into the thread on the bottom of the battery, which is a standard tripod. Fred. Uh, <clears throat> the other option for mounting them is an aluminium or carbon fibre mast and these come in 33 centimetre or one metre lengths. These are, have a standard VHF aerial mount thread at one end and the same thread as the solar sensor at the other, friend, other end. If you want to mount it wired sensor then use an adapter plug you can use mount with the wired sensor as well and again it will fit any VHF aerial mount so vertical horizontal doesn't matter which. Um, that's the range of Calypso instruments um, we're here to help so if you have any questions at all don't hesitate to contact us and many thanks for watching.